Hey guys, Craft here, and in today's video, I'll show you how to get the Sodium mod for Minecraft. And if you don't know, the Sodium mod is just a mod that basically makes the settings in Minecraft a lot better. So, you want to open up your browser and you want to type in Sodium. Not the chemical. You want to type in Sodium mod Minecraft. And you want to click on the modrinth.com, not the curseforge. And it should look like this. And you can click versions. And then click whichever one for the version that you want to use. It goes all the way back to 1.16.3. But today we're going to be doing the latest version of Minecraft 1.20.4. So you want to download that, and it should download it right there. Now you want to go to Fabric Mod Minecraft, and you want to go to FabricMC.net and click Download. Now you want to click Download for Windows, and it should download right there. And if you click this uh, button that says Fabric API, and it'll take you to a CurseForge page, and you want to click, you want to download the version that you are in. So you want to scroll down, click 1.20.4 or whatever version you're in, click on it, and hit download. Now you do have to wait a few seconds for it to start downloading, and it should download. Now you want to close out of your browser. And you want to open up your downloads files and you want to drag it onto the desktop. Now you want to go into the search bar and type percent app data percent and open up the dot minecraft folder and go to mods. Now you want to put the fabric API into this and the sodium into this folder. And that should do it. And I'm just going to get rid of these because I already have it in my mods folder. And then you can use the fabric installer. You want to choose your version and click install. And then when you open up the Minecraft launcher. And you want to click on this little drop down box and select fabric loader. If it does not pop up, don't worry, you want to go to installations, new installation, and find it should be right at the top or near whatever version you're playing in. Now, you can load up that version and play some Minecraft. And now I'm going to tell you what you can do with this. So if you just click on options and go to video settings, here is all the menu options. You can do all the max frame rates. You can do a bunch of different things. You can change the quality performance and advanced. And that is what that is. And it also boosts your FPS. So yeah, I know it does not come with this in-game account switcher, this is just another mod that I have, which just lets you join your own servers, and yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video, if you did, like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video, bye!